Up a lazy river where the old mill ran Meets the lazy river in the noonday sun Linger in the shade of What's happening? Welcome to the channel. My name is Kevon Golden, and today, everybody, we will be watching Power, the mid-season finale, episode five, season four. Um, this has been a pretty interesting season so far. Last episode, I thought it was probably going to be two major deaths from um, Drew and Diana. I thought both of them was going to... Um, be up out of it. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all, but Monet seems like she's finally trying to be a good parent after all them years. And that flashback, that flashback was just so funny from last week. That had to be the funniest flashback I have ever seen, probably in television history. It was just so. <laughs> I don't know what to say about it. Like, what type of mother is that? <laughs> but she did say Diana at the end, and they're probably going to be on some big happy family stuff if they can, but I don't know at this point. Um, Seems like the Sahara is going to be all right, but Tariq, I don't know. Tariq got these thirsty cops after him. Brighton, he did just set up the new business, if you want to put it like that. But he also on that pad of night. Like, he on that, nah, I mean, you know, that booger sugar. So, um, and he also have a new girl he met at this, met singing somewhere. Suggesting that he needs to be taken from the product they're supposed to be selling. So, yeah, that's just a recipe for disaster. I don't know how that's going to spin out. I don't know if it's going to end this episode or maybe on the other half of the season. But Power's mid season finales usually be interesting. Usually somebody get knocked off. I don't know who this time, but hey. I'm ready to see. And I want to see Councilman Tate. He is a very funny character. I love Councilman Tate always. Bro. <laughs> like, he always extorted anybody he <laughs> almost spoke to. <laughs> and I need to see a little bit more, more of that before this series ends. But other than that, if you want to see this full uncut reaction, go on here and subscribe to my Patreon. The link should be down in the description below. It's only $5, ladies and gentlemen. $5. This is a big, rich town. I just come from the poet's pond. On the cover, liar. I lie under the cover. Look a bitch in the eyes and tell her, baby, I love her. Oh, don't tell me and crack on his daughter. My mind, yeah. Getting off that oh! Fucking on the plus, daughter. Maybe we could do this again. <laughs> Maybe. Is this just for revenge, or are you cooking up a plan? I don't know at this point. I have sickle cell. And you don't cook? <laughs> <laughs> body loses oxygen so it feels like everything's about to shut down my whole body feels like it's on fire and it, it's like so cocaine helps this tiny piece of you? not an addict Brayden sometimes I just need a little extra pick me up to manage the other symptoms depression and anxiety so cocaine is the solution <laughs> to this madness <laughs> And I sure as hell. You're doing right now? What is going on? <laughs> you just said I'm not an addict. You just pulled a bump right there. Um, you haven't called me back. I was just calling to thank you. You are lucky to be alive, Diana. Sarit was going to murder you in cold blood. I can't well, a good meal was the one thing that always seemed to bring this family back together. No, 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 it hasn't. Good. We need to talk. I ain't got shit to say to them. Well, then you could be quiet, and I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> I said. Still treat him like a goofy. 
So anything I do moving forward is gonna be on my terms. Oh, on your own terms. Yeah, man. on my own terms, nigga. How's your face? <laughs> French toast, motherfuckers who try to kill you. Look, I'm, but we can fix it. I know we can. We just need a reset, man. We, we family. It's too late for all that, Monet. I'm here. Congrats on order, Diana. Shut up, Kane. I don't want to hear it. Yeah, but you need to, Diana. Because if I don't say it, nobody else will. But if you have this baby, it's gonna be the worst decision you ever make in your life. You hate to make that bad. We need to cut everybody off and get back to family first. I think I'm just gonna do my own thing away from the family. Look, you can't just run you away. You still trying to get them in the oh, game? Like, what, what is this? I mean, that's what we should be. Listen, sweetie, I promise I'm gonna do everything in my fucking power to get this family on the right track. For your baby. For my grandbaby. It's a lot of talking, Monet. Let's Monet, see it. <laughs> Diana is pregnant, bro. Diana is pregnant. And it's mine. What? Yeah. When were you fucking Diana? Last semester. You didn't know about Diana this? Effie was... Where the hell did you get this? <sighs> Mommy sent me to prep school my entire life. You really think I've never done coke? Be for real. The hundreds of everybody on cocaine this season. Education, not so you can get high. This shit ruins people's lives. Have you not heard about the fentanyl that's going around? Celebrity after celebrity is dying. Staring will make it go away. Man, you still working? I mean, I can't. I can't help it. I'm still. I'm sorry, I tried to murder you in cold blood, but hey, that's just life sometimes. You tried to shoot me last night. Man. Last night, what I was trying to do. You just make you so certain that that's my baby. You serious? I mean, you've been fucking Salim all last semester, so I'd be crazy to not ask that question. I always use condoms. You murdered him. You didn't. Yeah, because condoms always work every fucking time, right? Okay, I don't know what you're trying to say, but I'm not trying to pin no. You have a point. You ain't. So if I do keep this baby, the people in his or her life need to be clean. I can't have my baby anywhere near the life we had growing up. Now you're gonna act innocent, Diana. I already got big mama drawn. Your cut, Mr. McLean? Fucking right, that's my cut. <laughs> was this a one time thing for Davis or he permanently okay, in this? Who's supplying him? You know so. Oh, you gonna start a drug war? I heard their supplier is some British bitch, Noma. But we're not working with her. Hey, no shady shit, no backdoor deals. <laughs> I thought he was perfect. <laughs> I believe. He just hold him. Ah, uh, let's get out of there. It's like a new slip up out of there. Huh? You underestimated me. As I overestimated you. <laughs> like a little dog. Really? It's <laughs> always somebody like a hound dog. Belongs to you, right? Ain't mine. No? Ain't yours. He's lying. I can always tell when this nigga's lying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know that well, huh? Oh, it's number one thing. Turn my phone away. This is your mom. Yes. Sorry, Trick. I don't even know what you're talking about. No, no, no. I'm, I'm not tripping. I'm, I would love to stay in party with us, but you know, I gotta put a cap on the age. Shit gets me. I'll see you soon. He's slick with it. That little shit doesn't know when enough is enough. I can't wait to see his body turn cold. Fucking the plug's daughter came through clutch. What? What's bringing that? Get back there. B, are you fucking kidding me right now? I'm talking to you later. No, don't stop for me. I already know everything. What the fuck is she talking about? What is going on? Everybody just crashing out. As soon as y'all break up, she's gonna run her fucking mouth. You think I'm a snitch? I think you're an addict and I can't fucking trust you, honestly. Exactly. I don't care how deep your backstory is. Look at this shit. Do you think about anybody else but yourself? You're on the product. What is she talking about? <laughs> I get deep with acting this season. <laughs> it sounded personal. Know. <laughs> you know you can still stay in the house, Drew. That room is gonna forever be oh, yours. Good. Drew, listen, listen. I just wanna make things right between us. You tried to kill her. Shouldn't she be mad? At us? <laughs> Family's just business to you. Everything I've done with this business was for this family. What? 
<laughs> are you are you a mob now, my name? You had a gun in your child's face yesterday. This <laughs> for the first time. You're right, Drew. I want to say that every choice I made was for you kids, but I put the business first, and I can admit that now. I'm sorry. That don't sound sincere at all. <laughs> I want to bring the family back together. But in order to do that, I'm have to bring the business back. But this time, the business will serve the family. What, what sense is this making you give your kids back in the dark <laughs> He has no room to judge me. For sure. I know you'd agree. Has the world become this vote like right? you can't judge drugs mm -hmm. now? Like what's going on? <laughs> crackheads has always been crackheads in my heart of town. <laughs> I put a couple drops of acid in Tariq's water bottle. Are, are you fucking kidding me? What the, what is she talking about? He barely even smokes. This could really fuck him up. Yeah, maybe that's his problem. I don't know a single person. What is wrong with her? Earlier at the candy store. It was what the fuck wrong with this? <laughs> I can't hold it back no more. This is dumbest. Nah, who the f? Why you got this bitch out here tripping like this? You sure about this? Yeah. As long as we hit them right after the drop happens. We got a small window, so we need to be precise. They finna die. I don't know who they is, but they finna die. He better be right about this shit. I ain't got no time to waste. You motherfuckers say you want to be down with the Tahadas. I'm giving you a chance to prove yourself. Now you in or you out. I ain't asking again. They finna botch something so bad, it's finna be ridiculous. Don't get too big. What the hell is that? This day. It's like I own it. So basically, you're squatting on my property. The mistake is the restaurants, not ours, okay? It's just a oh, you don't know who this is, huh? It's a beautiful view of the city. Colonized territory that don't belong to them. Saying it's just a table. I feel the need to remind them of who's here. That security is horrible. Like, what's the point of even having these bodyguards around? Zion. Do you know him? I do. He's a client. Why? Ah, uh, there it is. Fuck out of here. Well, Come he on, man. Of... But Zion's unpredictable and dangerous. Well, so am I. Just trust me. No Davis, no security. Just me and you. This is where Zion used to fight when he was coming up. Now he runs. Yeah. Are you sure it's safe for just the two of us? You gonna fight him? This is agreed upon neutral territory. All right, so question her credentials. It's question of mine. She belongs wherever I do. Have a good one. Hey, hey. <laughs> I ain't know you got any bitch. He tried to treat him like Joe Jerko. One of them feeling this bitches, huh? <laughs> city, sweetheart. Yeah. Hey, cool. Yeah, bro. Fuck, you can't talk to me. What you think you doing, little nigga? How about we take this in the ring? You got the balls for that? Yeah, big ones. You got C-style in the name? Yeah. Come here with a Kamora? Right. Come on, and go for the lead. Then we go for the double lead takedown. Maybe a lead bar. Ankle, ankle lock. You got to feel yourself, Kane. <laughs> Ooh. I'm for a flying high me. Don't turn your back on him. Graveyard niggas are knocked off his ring. Ready to go? Oh my god. Brass nuts. Oh, y'all going to the WU staff? Big kill, they got big kills. Like I told you, you don't need no security. All you need is me. Because the security ain't worth shit. I gotta find a new way to move. I had to tell Zion about her. You did what? He was gonna fucking kill me. I had no choice. Oh, um, he's not gonna say shit. Whatever, bro. You don't coke, you snitching. Like, what's that? Like what else, man? Morning. My dad did a lot of dumb shit that I never agreed with, but. I got a lot of them in me. You red ghost, man. The good parts of him, the bad parts of him. You wait up for me, yeah? Oh, he crazy. Okay, yeah. He, 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 he crazy.
crazy. <laughs> Would you like to join me for a glass? Love to. Are you thirsty to the motherfucker? Ain't you okay? <laughs> So thirsty. Is this Drew? Oh, 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 this gonna be a shootout. Oh, oh, oh. No, 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 no. Oh my! What the hell? The they caught them in the act. Hands on the fucking head. Get the fuck off me. Turn around. They caught them in the act. I'm not gonna take you to jail. Cause the moment you get out, you're just gonna go back to doing what it is you fucking do. <laughs> so what the fuck do you want then? I'm giving you the opportunity to remain free. You follow the rules. So what you want to stop selling drugs? Ideally, this ain't a fucking ideal world, you feel me? He crooked as hell. So I got some simple rules. Listen carefully. Civilians should never be hurt in the process. You can kill all the criminals you want. You trying to control all the drug dealers in the city? Try. No, son, I'm winning. My task force decides who gets to operate in this city. Harm he is not playing fair at all. They finna flip Monet to Hala and Drew. You take her, man. She's the boss. You motherfucker. I knew you were snitch. Oh. Yeah. We killed Darian James two years ago. Please, let me go back to my family. <laughs> well, he didn't get to go home to his family, so... Why should you? What the fuck? All right, all right. Oh, I'm an innocent here. You want to read that bad, man? <laughs> so what the fuck we work for you now? Look at it this way. I'm giving you the opportunity to work with me. You can keep the product you stole. Just kill them. That's all you gotta do. You. People tend to believe him over scum like you. Well, shut up, bitch. <laughs> so now that we have an understanding. <laughs> so it's not sucking his Damn. As far as NYPD is concerned, you was never here. Oh, how did y'all f up this bad? Why don't you just take them out? Y'all been killing cops on here since <laughs> since the original power. I think I want to name him Lorenzo. That'd be cool, man. Okay. Go for that. Okay. Your father's name. I've been trying to get in contact with Salim, and I haven't heard back from him. Have you? No. Who, who is that? Don't okay, because yeah? something happens. So. Oh. You found me. I don't need to be out of this shit to protect y'all. I need to be on top. Okay, that's how I protect you too. Y'all got like five more episodes to become a king. Oh. You need to speed this up. <laughs> um, just another episode of Monet being a horrible, just a. Terrible mother. Um, I just don't know what to say at this point. She tries to get her family back together just to get them to sell drugs again. Monet, just get a regular job. <laughs> like, <laughs> you can do anything else besides sell drugs with your children. There's so many. Bi type of businesses you can start nowadays type of things you can invest in nowadays but no you still want to be the queen pin of new york <sighs> it's just, it's ridiculous at this point so to what she didn't got drew caught up in some and in, in, in a bunch of mess he was trying to be an artist what are you gonna be paying now where you gotta we getting distorted by the police you think you got time to paint now <laughs> I just don't know at this point. I just don't know. Tariq, he's been doing 
a lot of talking the like the last few episodes about how he need to be the man, he need to be the guy on top, he need to be the kingpin, the big shot, the the guy who you know calling the shots, you know. But he hasn't done nothing to like <laughs> do that. Like <laughs> Okay, he's got this new setup, but I don't think this is finna make him take over New York. They only doing, ain't they like doing like one concert? Or they maybe doing like three shows a week, maybe a Friday night show, maybe a Saturday show, maybe a Sunday show. They not doing this setup all week in multiple places, so it's kind of hard being a king pin if you only got one shop active <laughs> for three days a week. So he's gonna need to do something in his next half of the season to prove that he is really becoming the next type ghost or the next kingpin in New York, however he wanna put it. But other than that, he ain't doing nothing to, <laughs> to really apply that. Um maybe he finally just finished up the wars. Maybe they end on that. Um he might be cool with the Tahada family at the end of this. Um, but I still predict at the end of this, him and Kane will either have a fight or a shootout or a fight, I mean, a shootout first and then a fight because they, they've been building up to that for a long time. And I, I think I want to, I, I really want to see it at this point. It's just get that to me. I would be very happy. <laughs> But other than that, yeah, um, the way Tariq going, I just don't see him being the kingpin at this end, at the end of this show. I just, I just think something tragic gonna happen to him. But he is also a very smart individual. He always thinking of things and doing things ahead of time to get him out of certain situations. I don't know what he got planned for Noma's daughter, but hey, let's see where it goes from there. Um, the next half of this season, I would really love to see Councilman Tay and maybe Lauren again. She was, I thought her and Tariq kind of maybe connected again, but I don't know. She's just been missing action. Maybe she needs to stay away from all these people if she want to live and enjoy her life peacefully. But I would like to see her again on this show, Lauren and Councilman Tay in the next half. Maybe two bit, and I would probably love to see Tommy pull up. I don't care how they got to do it. I'd love to see Tommy pull back up to New York for the last half. Uh, but other than that, let me know y'all predictions to what y'all think on happened at the end of this, at the, of this series. Like, we only got five more episodes left when they come back. So, I admit my opinion, I think Tariq going to die, like I said, or going to get locked up. There ain't going to be no happy ending for it. I really think he's going to get locked up for the murder of the ghost, something that's he really thinks that's over with and going to come right back to bite him in the ass. But other than that, Thanks for watching, everybody. Let me know what y'all think, how this show going to end, some predictions. But thanks for watching. If you want to see this full uncut reaction, go on here and subscribe to my Patreon. The link should be down in the description below. It's only $5, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching. Up the lazy river with a robin song. Wakes a bright new morning, we can loaf along.